Hello. Hello. I'm gonna move my... Okay. So I'm hoping that this works. Um, I have been trying to stream this game for a little bit and it has been not compliant. Um, so the, the graphics are a little high end, I suppose. Um, I didn't know if it was my, um, my computer or my connection, but it seems like it's okay right now. I'm gonna knock on wood for that. Um, but it's staying about the rate that I want, so, okay, enough, enough of that. Um, I'm gonna be playing the Telos Principle. Um, I'm gonna start a new game. This is one of my favorite games, like, of all time. If not my favorite game of all time. Um, single player, at least. I like multiplayer, some multiplayer games might compete with it, but... For single player, um, this game is beautiful graphically. It's beautiful in its storytelling, and its puzzles are intricate and confusing. It's been a little bit since I played it, and I wanted to do like a run through of it just because I feel like if you haven't played it, um, then Behold, it's. Child, I'm gonna shut up. You are risen from the dust, and you walk in my garden. Hear now my voice, and know that I am your maker, and I am called Elohim. Seek me in my temple, if you are worthy. Okay, so that godly, booming voice, Elohim, I believe that means the great creator in Greek something? Um, but anyway, so yeah, we just learned that basically, so you walk through these purple things and the significance of them is that you are not allowed to take tools past them. Flip, see, goes away, doesn't let you take it. So that comes into play for a lot of the puzzles. Um, and also this is called a jammer. So it jams like the door, cause otherwise, right, I can't walk through here. So this game is just going to be about learning, uh, learning the tools, learning things. So I'm just going to do this for the sake of doing it. Look at this little robot guy. Get too close, it starts doing this. And then get even closer, then it explodes and kills you. So we don't like that. <laughs> we don't We don't want to die. Which way am I? Okay. So yeah, these are bad. That's a mini gun that will kill you. So you can jam the gates or you can jam the robots, jam things that would otherwise shoot you. So then, right, it's a little scary to be this close to something that can definitely end our, end our lives, theoretically, digitally, whatever. Um, but yeah, the jammer will keep you in, doesn't matter, you know, getting in its way. It's not anything like that. It just, like, points out an object. So, just for the sake of doing it, again, here's this, like, little minigun scanner thing, and it will shoot you and kill you. So, let's not die from these things. Okay, that's enough explaining. Let's do some solving. jam that as well. Kind of on the lookout. I don't want to get, like, exploded randomly by some... Oh! Hello! What are... Oh, I just hopped the fence over. Okay. I don't really know if that is anything important at all. So there's a ladder back here and not much else. Huh. All 
across this land, I have created trials for you to overcome. And within each, I have hidden... IOG child, oh hello. <laughs> it is your purpose to seek the sigils. finding the ladder. For thus, you will serve the generations to come. How are you doing? Eternal life. Okay, so Elohim is going to always preach at us. And it's kind of nice because his voice is like soothing. I guess this is just a hallway, a little outdoor walkway here, because I didn't find anything really useful in it. Ah, okay, big courtyard. Um, gate. Green. Te so this is like, I named the stream about the Tetris pieces because they're called tetraminos, I guess, which is like a Tetris piece. A four-blocked piece. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So these are green. And it looks like we'll find all three of these in here. Yeah. Okay, so let's start solving some puzzles. A switch out of reach. Okay. What do we want to call these dudes? Robot. That might be simple. Um, they explode. Boom bot, maybe. Do they have a name? Boom bot. Boom bot and minigun. That's pretty simple. Jammer? Anything in here? No, no, no. Alright. This game has a bunch of, like, Easter eggs and stuff, so I. Okay. Clearly need to jam that. Am I gonna get yeeted by this thing? Don't kill me. Okay, he's just kind of scouring the... This turns this off, yeah? Okay, I'm out of, I'm out of range of this anyway, so even if I... Yeah. Okay, so we're all good. And then we just... <laughs> okay. I... I... That was a little close. I was slightly scared. Not a lot, the but just slightly. The shapes collecting are not mere toys. They are the sigils of our name. Each brings you closer to eternity. Okay, sigils. Yeah, they're called sigils as well. Tetraminos, whatever. Pieces. Blocks. Things. Outnumbered. Hmm. It does look like there's some stuff going on there. Some stuff and some things. One jammer. That's good. I always just try to, like, my first plan of attack for any of the puzzles is just, like, just look at what I have readily available. And also, I hope I don't get scared randomly like that throughout this entire game. Okay, I don't need to... Oh, wait, 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 wait. That thing, the, the boom bot, it's bouncing back and forth on this. So if we jam it from a distance... And these things, I think, have, like, unlimited range. So then it's just outside and it just... Okay, there we go, there we go. Jam that minigun and that's trapped. Easy money. Green. Easy green. This is not gonna well open done, for me. Child. Only one more sigil is needed. His voice is just very soothing. Very godlike. Um alright. Striding the beaten path. Sorta of scary. Alright, so I have nothing to work with. I sort of just have to scoot by this. Ah, uh, don't kill me. Don't hurt me. No! Okay, that... There's a jammer over there. But I've managed to get by... Will it kill? Yep. Yes. It will. Okay, run, run, run. run. I can wait, I can wait. We can, we can wait. We know this. So wait, and then 
that one's bouncing, right? Surge so wasn't there. So we need to trap that guy. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm out of range. Don't do it. I, what am I doing? <laughs> I almost want Queen into that thing. Okay, this one's trapped. We're all good. Jam it and grab it. Let's go. Okay. My temple awaits you, child. Go for. Temple awaits us. I'm assuming not this way, but we need it. That was a little risky. Okay, his temple awaits us, he says. So we have three sigils. Uh, but there's other stuff over here. I can open this door with what I have. It looks like I have a completed set. I can rotate it with right click. I feel like these are easier to start out with, right? Oh, bad. It, okay, wait, put that back. There we go. My eyes have been opened. This world is not without order. It is shaped by a great designer with signs and poor tents to guide my steps. I'm one of his children. My challenges are set before me to test my faith. I don't know what poor tense means, but whatever the end goal of this grand challenge is, it's far to reach. Knowing that, how are we supposed to resist distraction? Hmm. Good question. Um, I want to get the other things. Hello. Uh, hi. Type help for a list of available commands. Help. Uh, list of available resources. Let's look at that. Sorry if I was a little loud at the meeting. I know you were nervous, but the truth is that this... That so was I. This may be hard to believe, but you intimidate me. You're so young and you've already accomplished so much. If the situation wasn't grim, I might even be jealous. There's also something I wanted to clarify. I realize that, nominally speaking, I'm head researcher here, but this is your project and everyone will respect that. Yes, I know you're not used to working like this, but as of today, you're in charge, no pressure. Let's do this, Nadia. Okay, so these are emails. There's another one here. The way I see it, the world doesn't come with a manual. You gotta figure it out for yourself. I'm not sure if I wanna read all of these on stream. <laughs> um. Everyone who claims to know it really does. Then again, that doesn't have to be a bad thing. We live in an amazing world, and searching for the truth can be a real adventure. Plus, it's good for the brain. Man, don't let this stuff get you down. Love, Dad. Hmm. Athena 6. Uh. Hmm. Okay, well... Let's run out my way and see what that does. Milton Library Assistant. How can I help you? Do you understand what I'm saying? Understand is a strong way to put it, but yes. You pointless contraption. Let's check their, their consciousness. Okay. Are you able to take offense? You cannot insult me. Okay, yeah, I knew that. Describe your functions would probably sort and classify data in the library library archive. Um, what are the terminals? P 
provide access to the library archives. How long has the system been running? A long time. Okay. Can you respond to queries on the outside world? My knowledge is limited to the data in the library archive, but you can ask about other topics. My response may be limited. Okay. Who's Elohim? Elohim. God. And, oh, it's Hebrew. Okay. I thought it was... What did I say? Greek? I don't know what I said. Uh, what am I? I'm locked in with the guest account. Where am I? Support session with MO. Okay, this is like humiliating answers. How old are they? First of July in 1995. What's the current status? Petabytes? Isn't that like over? Wait, it's uh. Byte, kil er, byte, kilobyte, megabyte, gigabyte, terabyte. Like, is that a byte? Petabyte? I don't know. It's, I don't know. If somebody knows, just tell me. I don't know how big that is, but it's a... Yeah, 30 billion photos, 7 million minutes of HD video. The entire internet of 03. Only 10.6 gigabytes of uncorrupted resources are indexed, though. What caused the data corruption? Progressive data corruption is inevitable in any system over time. Additionally, a large number number of inconsistencies were detected during sorting, leading to greater than average elimination. Okay. Well, looks like we're done here. We've read these. Help just got us here, so let's exit. Okay. Okay. Um. Here's the deal. I'm pretty sure, yeah, going in that right there will send me out of this, out of this world, but I haven't finished all of the sigils yet. So let's be sure that we get all the sigils here. Another one. Only the two of You do not need to collect all sigils at once. You are free to return to this place whenever you choose. But I want to. <laughs> I want to collect the sigil at once. Um, only the two of us. That sounds like my stream. It's also the name of this puzzle, but... Is there going to be something to scare? Oh, there's another jammer over here. Okay. I clearly have to jam this. Only the two of us meeting our two jammers. How sweet. Okay. So I need to jam things to get there, obviously, but I can't. So I... Okay, yeah. So having jammed this already with that one, I can still jam it just to hold, like, hold the jam. Hold the the result so that I can do this and then I think I should be able to just do that and be good. There's nothing else here. Like, theoretically there could have been something else and then I would have to do this trick again, but I don't know if I would have been able to walk in without dying getting shot by the minigun. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad at all. I think there's another one over here. So it looks like A? So it says like the thing, the set, right? At the top left. Like whenever you collect a sigil, it's like, this is what you're trying to collect. And get, this one's yellow. Peephole. Okay, purple thing. So I can't take this jammer over. Very sad. That jammer is already doing stuff. I'll jam this. But I can't, yeah, I can't take this out. I have to do what we just did, where jam that and then take it out. Aha. Is there another thing over here, though? 
do I just run? Yeah, there's another one right there. It's gonna it's gonna try to scare me. Yes, it's over there, all right. So point being, I have to jam this one with that one. You know that one, the one over. Geez. Okay. Is there anything over here, by the way? No. Cool beans. There's a sigil that's collected, and that's for a tool. That looks like, I forgot, like a connector or something? Um, cool beans. Okay, so we got those. Elohim, Elohim. I ha I probably will just go in between saying those two things like the entire stream. I don't know what I want to call him. Elohim, Elohim. He told us we don't have to do it all at once. We can always come back, but I kind of just want to do an entire world to appreciate it. Okay, yeah. So we're... Okay, this is telling me that we're done in there. That's good. We have a few others out here. This looks like it's part of A. Poking a sleeping lion. Hmm. Well... I would just go out on a limb and... T well, first of all, if I walk over there, I'll die. But if I just take that out, it will kill me immediately, and it will scare me. But I can... Wa oh, okay, I can walk around this. That's good. That's good. We have one jammer. Okay, I should... Okay. <laughs> the sigil's over here, I'm sure. Yeah. Okay, so my thought is to, I need that other jammer. So I need to be like a distance away. So, oh god, this is so scary. Even though I know it's jammed, I, I would definitely die. Okay, now jam that. Take this. Yeah, that thing would have totally killed me. Okay, now jam this, and then we're home free. The gates sometimes will collapse and sometimes they won't I don't know anyway step into the light child and my temple will be revealed to you is he gonna be mad at me if we keep going like no way right I should just be able to I don't know. I feel like I should just do it. It's probably just because I got close. That's like a indicator that I should do it. Oh, this looks scary. Trio Bombasticus. <laughs> Mr. Bombastic. Um. So calling those things, what did I say? Boom bots. That seems to be fitting. Um, they're all bouncing, so it looks like I have to sort of just get them, like, out. Where am I? What? Whoa, why? Relax. Okay, that one will leave. That one will leave. That one will leave. I still have to be a little careful of that one, I think. No, 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 just run on by. Cool beans. This trait will serve you well in times to come. Thank you, thank you. Um, I think we're, yeah. Oh, there's a star here that I didn't find. We will, s well, we can star hunt later because we do end up we do end up meeting them. I think there's like not a way to finish the game without them. But you walk now upon the stones of my temple whence many gates lead and know that i have other temples for my garden is greater than your eye can encompass and all these worlds i made for you do i take a do i do i find stars and may i was thinking that i should just like do the puzzles and if i find a star then like figure out how to get it in the moment, but some of the stars are hidden. 
So I was kind of just thinking, like, go through the puzzles and enjoy the game, and then once we get to the point that we need them, go find the other ones that I don't have. There's one star in World 2. There's seven worlds here? Lands? World? What am I in? What is this? Let this be our covenant. These worlds are yours, and you are free to walk amongst them and subdue them. Okay. But the Great Tower, there you may not go. For in the day that you do, you shall surely die. Okay. Big Temple bad. Big Temple bad. List. Library archive currently unavailable while system resources are redirected. Cool. I guess we run the troubleshooter. MLA, what did it say? Oh, yeah, Milton Library Assistant. Is there something you'd like help with? Troubleshooting. Please enter the dome admin password to authenticate your privileges. Oh god, what do we think it is? I said god right there. So should I put god? QWERTY, let me in, or admin? Um... God? I think I'm gonna go with god. No, 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 no. Because even... Well, I don't know. Let's try it. Cool. Nice. Yeah, I know. It's not that. Uh, let me in. It's bad again. Um, I trust no one. Uh, create a new admin account. All right. I don't know if there was any correct answer there. I have to be, I'm, okay, so now I'm taking, I have to make, time as a factor in this, two plus two is four. What is your subjective reaction? It looks happy, it's a face. It looks like a face to me. What best describes a person? Between a human being and a rational animal. Because technically an animal, like a dog or a cat or something, has negative entropy, right? But I thought the entropy of the universe is like universe favors. Um the universe favors maximized entropy not a problem solving system because that could be a calculator um i'm gonna go with a human being you're walking through the desert and come across a thirsty traveler his eyes bulge, bulge from slow dehydration you have water but you're not sure how far it is to the next oasis what do you do Um, man, I think I would offer half. Is that wrong? Nobody yell at me. I'm offering half. Exit. There was probably no correct password in that first thing, by the way, because I think it just wants us to... Oh, here are the resources. Let's see if I want to read any of them. First day at the Institute of Applied Nomadics. Yeah, the, the, so Ian, right? That's, I think that's who's like behind this Italis principle. Um, 
yeah. I don't know. If anybody wants to read these emails, I, I might read them if they're, like, interesting, but I feel like it's people aren't gonna want to watch the game if I'm just reading. <laughs> but you can pause it. And go back later. Hmm. Corrupted data. Okay. Well, that was interesting. So I guess that happens at each um, world, or probably at least one computer. Yeah. Alright, let's go solve some puzzles. What does this guy have to say? I don't know what this place is, nor it seems does anyone else. Nothing to do but move forward and note whatever I find. Well... Yeah. <laughs> that seems accurate. Hall of Windows. Okay. That scared me. Alright, so I can't take a scanner past here, but I can use the scanner for, say... Uh, for, say, this. And then I have one scanner. Jammer, not scanner. Um, probably something else, I would imagine. There's nothing else. Um, what? E oh, I see, I see. Okay, wait, let's reverse jam this. And then switch this over. That. So that I can take this one, jam this, and then I think we're good. Okay, mildly confusing, but good. You are learning, as is your purpose. But your choices must be your own. Therefore, I will not guide you unless it is necessary. Free will. Got it. This place is pretty. I don't think I can swim anywhere though, because it'll just lead me back to. Yeah, he didn't like that. My bad, my bad. Okay, this is the one that we just did. We can go over here. Okay. Suicide mission. It's fine. Yeah, we're an android, so we don't like water anyway, I guess, right? But I, oh. Well, there's a minigun there. Is that gonna get activated by something, or do I deactivate it myself? Was there a... Oh, there is. Yeah, there's a jammer here. Okay, hold on now. This is hitting against the... Um, I think this will blow... Wait, hold on. I can't just turn this on because then I'll get lit up immediately. So, jam it. And turn it on. Oh yeah, those two things do not like each other, so, but we like that. We like that, because then they blow each other up, and then that's two negatives combining to make a positive. Hmm. What 
Where am I? <laughs> what the? You scared me. What are you doing, bud? Okay. Well, that was interesting. Another computer. Ah, uh, part two. Let's do it. Since all human beings are persons, and some human beings have psychological capacities similar to animals, some animals are therefore persons. What? Some human beings have psychological capacities similar to animals. What does that, what does that mean? I don't know if I agree with that. I would like an example before, I'm gonna say I disagree with that. Person is under no authority other than that to which they consent. No, no. Government. Well, do you consent to? I'm gonna say I disagree with that. Policing, government. Quality of life of persons ought be maximized. Yeah. Sure. Value is discovered. <clears throat> yeah, I think you can discover value, but I don't think that you need to discover value for it to be there. So... I think the way that it's asking it is like... It's not there until you discover it, so I will disagree. Persons deserve the talents they were born into. Sure. The liberty of persons ought be maximized. Um... Yeah... I'm not saying that I disagree with freedom, but I think, you know, there's consequences for some actions. I'll agree with that. Because it maximized it. Value is created. That I disagree with. It, I guess it can be created in some ways. But it's not always created. Oh, there's other things here. Yeah, I see that's just a bunch of corruption. One day you discover that you are not a human being, but a machine. Oh man, this is tough. Uh, Gordita Freeman. I hope I'm saying that correct. You like what I said about value existing even if we don't discover it. I feel like that's... I already know that this computer is going to try to, like, mess me up, right? Like, they're going to try to, like, make me trip on my words, so I'm trying to be real careful. But yeah, I mean, I feel like, you know, some people struggle with their value because they haven't seen it yet, but it doesn't mean that it's not there. So I'm glad that you agree with that. Thank you for your input. Thank you for the follow. Um, this one I think I might read. It seems interesting, so just put ourselves in this situation. One day you discover that you're not a human being, but you're a machine. Your life so far was real, and no one controlled you or programmed you to behave in some specific way. Your physical and mental capacities are identical to those of an organic human being, but you were created in a lab. 
So no one except you knows about this, your family, friends, they all think that you're a regular human being just like themselves, and you could continue to live your life the way that you have before and nothing would change. How do you react? Um, does your concept of yourself change? Are you the same person you thought you were? Um, my concept of myself would certainly change. I mean, that's probably unavoidable because I would wake up and be like, I'm a machine. You know, that's that's definitely different. Um, oh God, see, this is where... Am I the same person I thought I was? No, because I thought I was a human, but I'm a machine, so I would say no. Does your understanding of the world itself change? Maybe if I thought that I was a human for so long and then I wake up and I'm not, maybe I would start to question things, so sure. And do you reveal the information to others? That's the big one, or do you keep it to yourself? Um, I would probably tell people close to me. I would be interested to hear your guys' thoughts on that one. That's one of the more interesting uh, emails. So I would be interested to hear your thoughts. Writing because I refuse to believe in scenarios with absolutely no solutions. If we all put our heads together, we can figure something out. Crazy, crazy is better than dead. Okay. Do you think you would have more value as a human than a machine? Ooh. Um. I don't know. Because I think that there's something that, you know is delicate about human nature because as a computer as a machine i feel like you're sort of you know you could be infinite per i mean like assuming that you don't break right then and your data doesn't corrupt things like that like you there's no like timeline on you so maybe i guess just from the fact that like my time um in and of itself is more valuable than a machine's time because it's a larger fraction of my life than it would be for theirs. Okay, back to s the guards must be crazy. Please don't scare me. Okay, that would have scared me for sure if I popped out. And okay, there's another one. So I gotta wait. Is he gonna come? Yes, he's gonna come down the whole hallway. Yeah. Cool. What did I do? Press X on accident. Sorry. Okay. Anyway, so can I be out of reach of this guy and he not kill me? Don't kill me. 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 Okay, turned off. Let's go. Who? 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 Okay. Okay. Let's wait a sec. Should I pass? No, 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 no. He'll kill us. Okay. Okay, he's going crazy, but let's just slip in at the last second. Okay, alright. That's good stuff. I hate walking by them. Even if they're even if they're jammed. I just don't like being so close to it. I'm gonna do the double jam just to be like just this gives me so much Whew, I don't like it. Okay, it's it's oh, here's the sigil. If only we were slightly athletic and could just put a shoe right there and just jump over. That seems to be a common theme in the games that I play. Lots of physical barriers. Okay, and then I jam this one. Let's wait. I'm assuming that this is just going to come out. And then we'll just let it be out. Yes. But I, um, I, st <coughs> I still need to jam this. I would like to not have it. Oh, well, okay, hold on. I want it to be like far away. <laughs> yeah. Okay. One thing about these boom bots, I'm pretty sure they can't like kill you through even through these gates here. They can see you, but they won't kill you. Okay. He'll hit. All right. Now's the time. So jam that. And then I need to grab this one. Don't. Just don't. 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 Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Okay, can I just get through like this, or is there another one? Oh, okay. Gate, please. Thank you. Oh. 
Okay. A little stressful. It's fine. Something here. When I was a little girl, one of our teachers, Mrs. Listen. Higgins, told us to make a time capsule. Write letters to the future so one day we could remember what it was like to be children. I thought it was stupid, so I didn't do it. Which I really regret. So, <laughs> I guess I'm gonna make one now. Bury it in the archive instead of under a tree. I don't know if anybody will ever find it. Okay, good point um, from Gordita Freeman about, um, I would call that probably expendability, where machines, I guess, could be expendable in the sense that they can be replaced, and humans cannot be replaced. We can replace. See, that's sort of where it sort of gets into, like, the philosophy of the situation, though, because you can replace, like, prosthetics is technically a replacement, but you can't replace the entire human being. You can't replace a soul, I guess. But I know that this game is probably going to grill me about that. We need to come to some agreement. Another another computer? Okay, we're in World 3. I'm also yet to find a star, but, you know, we'll get there. Let's see if this yells at us for our answers yet. Nope, just emails. AI feed. Artificial intelligence would mean and what is it? Okay, so for anybody who's new viewing, I said that I'm probably not gonna read like all of the emails, only the ones that like seem interesting I'll go through if they spark up interesting conversation, but I don't think people wanna just hop on Twitch to read. So the puzzles are super interesting, the philosophy is pretty interesting, but you know, I have no way of knowing if it's gonna be relevant or not reading through everything, so if it seems interesting. Um, okay, a lot of writing was lost in the destruction of the Library of Alexandria. I guess that's sort of relevant here because a lot of the data was corrupted. Okay, here we go. So, Alexandra Drennan is the project lead in AI module. So, this is also the person, I'm pretty sure, that we just heard on that tape. So it seems like directly the archive team is sharing both physical and digital space. Okay. All right. So nothing extremely interesting, but food for thought, I suppose. So there are four sigils, and we have a red one here now. This is interesting. Do we get the red one first? It's new. Are the red ones harder? Is it like green, easy, yellow, medium? I know they're for different things, but yeah, let's just let's let's stick with the the green one before I like get my ego killed here. Stashed for later. Cool. Okay, is this stashed for later? I hate this because if I did, I mean, I could deactivate that and then it would just kill me. Um. Dead core, I've not heard of. Gordita Freeman. Um, Portal, I love. Portal, I played both Portals and enjoyed them very much. Um, this game's awesome. I played it like a year ago. I think a year ago. But I didn't like 100%, 100% it. I completed the tower ending. And I just wanted to come back because it's was super fun and yeah i i was definitely obsessed with it when i played it okay i'm a little confused <laughs> because okay there's this oh well well no 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 no. okay so i can't i objectively just can't grab that or else it'll kill me so i need to be wary oh there's keys over there run maybe just run okay got it i got the keys or the key. Yeah. Okay. Don't kill me, please. Are you gonna come over here? No. Okay. So I just need to be wary of this guy. There's too many guns. Oh my goodness. There's a lot of stuff. Use the key. Yes. 
finally a jammer. So now, technically, we have two jammers, though, because I can jam this from afar. Get jammed, and then grab this. And I'll just jam that, just because... Because I want to know what the deal is. Are there other jammers here? No? Do I? Okay, I think ultimately I just have to jam the two miniguns, but I also have to get past this guy. What? What? What's gonna kill me? <gasps> that scared me, man. Oh. I will, at some point, I will die from, like, nothing. I'm anticipating doing that quite a bit. What is jamming this? That's jamming it as well, I think. Hopefully. Okay, yeah. So now I can bring both of them, and we can just jam the miniguns and call it good. Boom bots are way scarier than the miniguns, because the miniguns don't move. And for some reason, like, getting shot multiple times, is it's like a little bit more progressive, progressive than just a sudden explosion. It scares me. It's like a jump scare. Okay, apparently the yellow ones are on either side of the map, so let's visit that before the red. A bit tied up. That's doing nothing. This is being jammed by the hell. What? Alright, so we have three jammers now, and I'm assuming we need all three of them. So which one is... Okay, I jam this from afar. Be sure to grab the right one. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me. Okay. And then I jam... Wait. Wait, no, 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 no. I have to jam it again, don't I? Oh, no, it's already jammed. No, it's fine. So I jam this, and then grab this one. Please don't be... If I'm ever wrong, then I will just die. Okay, now I have three jammers. That's pretty good stuff. If I'm not... Oh, there's... What? And that. Do we have anything else going on? Yeah, we have more stuff here. <laughs> what? Where? Oh, oh. I forgot about that thing. Nobody judge me. What's gonna kill me? Maybe? Oh. <laughs> That's the noise that happens when, when they get close to. Okay. Alright, yeah, I could have just let that happen. Alright. So that's jammed. That's jammed. That doesn't need to be jammed anymore. Oh, there's a star right there? Well, that's nice and easy. How about that? And I don't even actually need the... Okay, yeah, just the third jammer was just for the star, that's it. Alright! Looks like we have the opportunity to get a new tool, but let's not leave here without the red. Is it that one? No. Oh yeah, it is that one. Okay, hopefully this isn't like stupid hard. Um, thank you, Gordy. <laughs> I'm, you're definitely free to laugh at me whenever I get scared like that. These things are scary. Am I wrong? These are definitely like way scarier than the miniguns to me. I spent much time waiting for the designer to take my hand until I realized that he'd been guiding me all along. I realized that it isn't for me to seek his help. It is for me to help myself. Well, good for you. What's in here? Nothing. Go away! Alright, we gotta wait for this thing to get bumped again. There's a jammer. How far is this gonna go? Okay, I was gonna say there's no way that, can I grab this? Yes, I was expecting that to not work. Ah! Okay, all I know is that I can trap it in here. So let's do that.
Is there any importance to the... Because, I mean, I can... Is there any importance to this? Maybe. Um, I guess we'll just keep... There's keys. Oh my... Oof, this one has everything. Is there another jammer somewhere? What? Proximity mines. Prox bots? Is that better than boom bots? Wait, I just realized... Wait a minute. If I could grab it from up here, then I can grab it from down here, right? Because that's the only, that's gonna be the only way that I can have this scanner. Put it on this little thingy. I'm not sure if that works. Because otherwise, there's no scan- there- why do I keep calling it a scanner? Jammer. Yeah, okay, good. Grab it, that's- that's good. 90, yes, the floating mines can make 90 degree turns. Which- bleh, go away. That's where I just came from. So we need to go this way. I see keys. Eee, chill. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. We're cool, man, we're cool. No. Run! There's another boom bot. Yeah, it's coming my way. This will activate, but it won't kill me. Okay, keys gathered. Good. I'm going to follow this bot. Because I don't want to try to risk it. And okay, and this one's just going to... That one I will outrun. I'm going to try at least. Yeah. Okay, we're much faster than them, but they're much more explosive than... It. Okay, I don't have use for that right now. Um, I only have one jammer. Meaning that I need... Okay. I fell. Meaning that I need boom guy to blow that up. So, let's go get boom guy. Oh, I can just stay here to get boom guy, actually. Here you go, friend. You're gonna help me out today. And you can go faster at any time. Okay. Snipe? No! I didn't snipe it. Sad times. Now we have to wait again. Oh, wait, no, it's coming that way anyway. Yay! Kaboom! Boom! Yeah, let's go. Okay, that, yeah, okay, I'm gonna go out on a limb and just say that the red ones are harder. Maybe that's just recency bias for this one, but this one had, like, anything that you can imagine so far. I mean, it had the, it had, like, two separate places, it had the keys, it had, like, only one jammer, but a bunch of different doors, so... The red ones definitely seem like they're more difficult. Noted for the future. Uh, we found a star here. Uh, I don't have everything. I thought I had everything besides the red one. Okay, my bad. I missed something. Let's go get this. Locked me up and swallowed the key. They're such scary names. Why? Oh, there's a key. Okay. Stuff. Let's scan the place first. This is the only thing I found so far. Well, gotta get in the old fashioned way before I can get a key. Okay, there's a bunch of stuff. I need stuff as well. To okay, let's start. So now we can get that jammer in, I believe, yeah? Because we hit the key button. And 
grab her. Bring her in. Okay, so was that all that was over here? Probably, right? Yeah. Well, where do we want to go now? Try this direction and see what's over here. A, a jammer, so cool. That's good. We might have to do the door trick. The double, the double jammer. Yep. Okay, that one actually didn't end up being so bad. They're fun though. Just jamming problems. Okay, now we have everything, right? Now we, well, there's a star missing, but like I said, excuse me, sir. Who are you and what are you doing in my, my world? Elohim says it's for me, go away. I didn't mean to, like, I didn't think I would actually kill him. Wait, this is saying, oh, my profile got generated. So let's download it. I can't wait to get yelled at. Congratulations, would you like to see the details? Yes. Display psychological profile. Oh boy, all right. You may already be criticizing your own performance, but it's clear you understand how the world of ideas affects you, even if you are sometimes weary with the realities and allow your preferences to dictate your beliefs. Okay, I feel like a lot of people's preferences dictate their beliefs, right? You have a great deal of unused capacity, ouch, which you have not turned to your advantage. <laughs> Disciplined and self-controlled outside, you tend to be worrisome and insecure inside, but pride yourself as an independent thinker and do not accept other statements without satisfactory proof. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that sounds accurate. How? I'll just, all right, let's look at other stuff. Account privileges. Due to outstanding notes on your account and despite displaying many of the characteristics of being a person, you cannot be granted admin status at this time. Nice. <laughs> what about conflicts? Am I right? People who are watching, I feel like your beliefs or your preferences will sort of dictate your beliefs, right? Because why would you believe something that you don't? Well, I don't know. That you can't, like, support, you know? Logically. Um, user provide an objective response when asked for a subject of one. Okay. User provided a particular amount of personhood, but was uncomfortable with its implications. That, okay. User sought to maximize both liberty and quality of life, but these ideals are incompatible. Hmm. Liberty and quality of life are incompatible? In what form? Freedom and quality of life. That's liberty, right? Like, just the freedom. I don't know. I'll just access the comm portal. And do nothing with it, because this is already what it's doing. Log MLA support ticket. Do you think humans use logic much when forming beliefs? I would like to think so. Um, the problem with that is that there's definitely different, I mean, it's a good question. I think that there's different frames of logic. Um, and there's some logic that is, like, sort of manipulative. But when things break down to, like, black and white, if they can break down to black and white, then it's probably best to look at it from strictly a logical perspective. That's a personal thing. Um, a lot of this is, I suppose. I wasn't able to better assist you if you're still encountering an it. But yeah. Yeah, I'll just type ARG. Yeah, it looks like we're done here. We've seen everything that we need to see. Uh, these are, we've seen these, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've seen these. AI feedback, this is the 
Artificial intelligence, team leads, is like a list of people. Yep, okay. All right, well, that's fine. We made our account and we have every sigil in this land. Um, I've been streaming for about an hour now, so I think I'm gonna do one more world, this world here for, and then probably call it for the night, but I'm planning on streaming. I love this game, so I'm planning on being diligent about streaming this one. Well, we still have some more puzzles to go, so let's do those first. These worlds, and we within them, are made of words. Hidden words, invisible to you, yet part of all things. We are a story. Your actions give life to the story, and the story gives meaning to your life. <laughs> Uh, Gordita Freeman, thank you for um, hosting. And can you elaborate a little bit on what you mean reassess? Do you mean like as far as what like beliefs go, and then when presented with facts, do they reiterate them? Do they like allow them to um, apply to their beliefs? Because I would think. I would say that unfortunately that's less tr that's happens less often than it should um, and I'm not a stranger to that I think that self-serving bias is very real and sometimes in the face of directly contradictory evidence people will try to ignore it and look for anything that supports their already upstanding point of view if that's what you meant so I'm sorry if <laughs> I butchered that um, let's take a look and see if any of these are Interesting. Mostly corrupted. That's, yeah. Keep this short. Numbers. <laughs> nice. I can read that. And then beginnings. Um, okay. Let's read this one because we were just talking about it on stream. Um, it is the grave error of many philosophers, and I would substitute just people in there, that not only of the Athenian schools, but also of many others, that they begin not with observation of cosmos as it surrounds us, but with a conclusion already in mind. And often that conclusion is the world, is that the world was created ideal and mankind itself um, the greatest creation of the gods. Yet neither the world nor the gods owe mankind perfection. It is arrogance itself to presume so, and contrary to all the methods of philosophy. The honest philosopher seeks only the truth, even if it bears no comfort, and he must begin by assuming, as Socrates said, that all he knows is that he knows nothing. So, um, we can't assume and go into something, especially something as, right, as, um, abstract and as like vast as like the universe and things like that with a conclusion in mind you just sort of have to take as this so it says they begin not with observation of the cosmos as it surrounds us so like not with just taking in information as you see it and as it comes to you to just like logically deduce what's going on and assess the situation but um you already want something to be an outcome, so you'll just look for input that supports that outcome. A man convinced against his will is of the same option, opinion still. I like that a lot. Um, and that sort of goes into, it not sort of, it directly goes into what I was saying, and I agree with you. Access data cleared. Anyway, like I was saying, um, it sort of, uh, it definitely supported, um, our ideas are synonymous. Um, I 
I need a piece of equipment for this that I don't have, it seems like. Well, I said that I would finish this world before popping off, so that's what I'm going to do. So let's just go, let's go up here and see what this is all about. I can do this one. I cannot do this one. This is the, I think, what is this? I don't know. This will work. Cool beans. Nice. There is much that you may learn in the halls of my temples. There is much that you do not know. True. That is why you are a child. But children are made to learn, and in time they come to have dominion over the lands of their home. So it shall be with you and your generations. That's very promising. That's assuming that I can make it through this. But thank you, Elohim. I appreciate your support. Okay, now I walk in and it doesn't blink and yell at me. So, blue and gate. Let's figure this out. Well, there's the laser. And the, oh, two connectors. Pointed at a target and then, okay, so. I gotta be back here. And these do... They have a... They have a range, right? Like a... Uh, like they can't be too far away. Maybe maybe that's not true. It just has to be at a good angle. Because you can't do it like through here, right? Like I can select it, but then if I push it down... Wait. Yeah. It doesn't quite work. But I do get it from here. Beautiful. Okay, we're learning to connect. And I believe that's a box right there. That, well, I don't know. We'll see. That is used later on. So we are rolling. Branch it out. Sigil. Okay, so this is... Uh, this thing is like overworked, kind of. There's a connector up there? I can point at the- I mean... Just do this, do this literal same thing. Okay. <laughs> All I had to do is... Connect that one thing, that's not so bad. The range is limitless, extreme distances will come in handy later. Okay. Star hunting, I'm assuming, yeah. Don't cross the streams or else you get this purple explosion thingy. Never cross streams, fellas. Uh, do I have to go around? Because there's no way that... Because if I connect these, it'll just be... Yeah, okay. Um, I can do the blue one. Okay, go away. The other blue one. Like, as far as it can go. Right here, maybe. Okay, get out of the way. Perfect. And then just a, a nice little straight shot there. Yes! Beautiful. That wasn't even part of the... Oh, wait, we already have the box. Okay. I was about to... I was about to rage. Not actually, but, you know, quiet rage. Fake rage. Okay, is this the third or fourth? Above all that... Glitch. Um... We can't cross the streams. There's a... I can see the blue one from here. But I can't see the red one, I don't think. So I'm assuming right... 
we can connect and it's like a butt so it won't cross oh that's already set up that's nice i don't even have to worry about that one just set it like here at the corner yes beautiful sigil sigil There's an audio device over here, I think, is what these are. The answer that came to me again and again was playing. Every human society in recorded history has games. We don't just solve problems out of necessity. We do it for fun, even as adults. Leave a human being alone with a knotted rope, and they will unravel it. Leave a human being alone with blocks, and they will build something. Games are part of what makes us human. We see the world as a mystery, a puzzle, because we've always been a species of problem solvers. I kind of like that. Especially since my channel is completely dedicated to puzzle games, so... Obviously, right? But, yeah, I kind of like that. Um, leave a human alone with a knotted rope and they'll try to untie it. That is accurate i would that's definitely something that i would do but also that's assuming you're just bored right and have like nothing to do the music in this level is almost identical to the game playing half-life 2 is half-life fun i've never played half-life and also what genre does it fit into before you answer i'm just gonna make it known that like i love puzzle games and i actively seek out like puzzle adventure games but I, um, part, part of that is because I'm just horrible at first-person shooters. I'm just awful at them. They're, I'm just bad. All right, let's take a look-see here. Um, it's done, but I kind of have a hint. Uh, I feel like I want to do more. I'll do one more. I'm at 118 right now. Um, let's go to let's go to world five. There's five sigils here. Okay, yeah, five might be a good time to cap it off. The main character of Half Life is Gordon Freeman. Is that where you get your name from? This is cool. It's depressing. It's cool. That means nothing to me. Yeah, so he, I'm not gonna go through this one fully, but this is something to think about and something that I'll bring up actually, just in case anybody wants to chime in. But so once, uh, well, okay, maybe I'll go over it. I don't know. Once a true artificial intelligence has been created, the issue of uh, citizenship is going to come up. If we acknowledge that the AI has all the abilities of a human brain, should it not be considered a citizen? And is it not, in the legal sense of the word, a person and thus a potential citizen? Um, this is why I didn't choose, right, in the creation of our profile, I didn't choose a citizen as being a person, quote, because um, what does citizen mean, right? I mean, there's citizenships in different... You know, there's some people, like, I could be a citizen, right, in the U.S., but not a citizen in another place, a part of the world, and then vice versa. So citizenship is a little bit um, subjective, maybe, or culturally subjective. So I guess this is considering, right, like, not considering differences in culture, but just, like, within the U.S., right? If you have, if there's an AI that looks kind of like me, talks exactly like me, you know, thinks exactly like me, has all of the same capabilities, but they're a machine, why are they not a citizen but I am? Just because I'm warm-blooded, right? Just because I, I run on biology rather than electricity or whatever it may be, you know? So 
where yeah where do you draw the line um will great apes become citizens elephants whales the more intelligent parrot species it's crazy they'll say i'll remind these people we live in a society in which a corporation as abstract an entity as one could imagine is considered a person so it's not like there's a pre there's no precedent for a non-human being as a person at least an artificial intelligence is an actual thinking being and not just a business arrangement um This one's tough. Um, is that my half left too? Oh boy. You're probably way better at uh, first person shooters than I am. I'm just, I'm horrible. <laughs> They're fun, but I'm just bad at them. I like Spellbreak. That's a fun, like, battle royale. But it's not really. Is that an FPS? Maybe not. You must consider these riddles. Um, oh, I like riddles. I think, she finally said, the riddle you did not reveal is this. Why do these riddles exist in the first place? Why do these curious automations, these mute children of Hephaestus, Hephaestus, behave as they do, forcing me to devise these intricate solutions? Each is a riddle, but the greater riddle is their purpose. The Sphinx did not answer. Her eye was lifeless. Huh. That's the whole, like, Socrates... Jesus Christ, like, answer a question with a question. But I think this goes back to third person. <laughs> yeah, true. Um, I think that this paragraph specifically goes back to um, it goes back to the tape that we just recently found that's, like, humans just like to play games, right? Humans like to solve puzzles. You leave, you leave it me, right, especially people who, anybody who's watching this, if you like puzzles, right, alone in a room with an, a knotted rope or with, like, a Rubik's Cube or, you know, something of the sort, then you're going to try to solve it because otherwise, you know, we would rather do puzzles than nothing, I would say. At least try. So, you know, why do riddles exist in the first place? Well, they're fun. They're interesting. It's nice. It's a that, that epiphany moment, you know, when you finally figure something out. Um, uh, see, uh, now I don't have the box, so we have to go back. I'll get that audio tape later, but yeah, I have to go back for the box. Uh, I keep messing things up, but we'll we'll get all of the materials eventually. Should AI be citizens of a given nation? What country would claim 100% production ownership of it when? these component that's very true um how would i think this works how you know i guess i, I feel like the, the point that they're sort of making in that instance dead core i am going to look it up literally after this stream because i'm always looking for i had this one planned for a while i love the talus principle and i wanted to share it um, rep I wanted to replay it first of all, but I wanted to share it with people as well. Um, but I will look that up after this stream. Yeah, I'm always looking for new games like that. It could be. School when I first read about the Talos principle, it disturbed me at the time. It made me hyper aware of my body as a physical object, the material reality of the brain. Ideas that made me uncomfortable at first, but. Okay, people are just talking. The convex hole is a decahedron. Wrong? <laughs> dog V55. Okay. All hail dog V55. This guy's goaded. If we see him, he just he just ended every conversation ever on the internet. Wrong. Um, Alright, so let's look around and find things. We've now unlocked boxes, so I think that boxes are going to be... Yeah, so we have two. It's a hexahedron, okay. So there's a gate. I'm assuming I just... Oh. Never mind. I was gonna try to... Do things with it. What? 
Wait, what? Where's the- oh. <laughs> I am blind. Yes! Relax. Relax. Checkmate, dog. <laughs> okay. Can I block them off with the- Don't touch me! Oh, he'll bounce off of it. Okay, wait, I can cut through here? Don't touch me, don't touch me. Ah, don't kill me! Oh! The flash, the flash of lightning, I thought was the, the boom bot killing me. No, I need a box. I need a box to get to the, oh no. Okay, oh, that's definitely gonna kill me. Okay, 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 be careful, dude. Okay, stay away, grab it. Don't touch me! Okay, they're 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 uh, they're disheveled. They're rotating, so I can just sort of run in between them and then wait for a second. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Okay. Oh, 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 stressful. Okay, so wait, wait, do I do I take this for any reason? Maybe. Thank you. What are you? If the designer is perfect and he designed me for a purpose, I must be fit for that purpose. It follows that my purpose must not be to seek and hoard every sigil in his land, for so many are beyond the fac faculties that he granted me. Also, the storm kind of stopped. That's an interesting thought. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. There's a star right there. What did you say? I don't understand why the designer chose to put such flaws into the world, that it appears almost as if it were damaged. But I must believe that there is a purpose here that I cannot see. Well, that's... Yeah, that's kind of intense. I Okay, I have this box. I want to figure out how to get this star, because I said I wouldn't star hunt until the end, but I also... Like, if I have the stars, then I want to... Or if I find them randomly, then I want to be able to try to, try to get them. Um, but there is a problem, because I think I need to... Okay, I'm gonna have to run through again. Don't touch me. Don't touch me! Okay. I don't have a box. <laughs> that is a logical fail. True. That is true. There's so much... Yeah, like... Logical fallacies. Everywhere. At least it's pr a lot of the information is presented in like a convincing way, even if it doesn't make a lot of sense. So it's fun to sort of like shovel between them and figure out what you think is justified. Okay, I don't know if I would get the star through here. Is there something like over? Uh, maybe through this. Okay, let's go to this one. Next. It's red, so it's probably gonna be hard. But Friendly crossfire. Yeah, maybe maybe through this one. If the designer is perfect, I must be blah blah blah. That ignores the tension. That's scary. That's scary. It's facts, but it's scary. Okay, lots of stuff going on here. That's hitting this box, which is keeping it from getting, from murdering that thing. Is there another? Ah, oh, I just have to go run and grab that box, I think. Unless, oh wait, is there stuff over here? Uh, ye, well. I think that's gonna kill me. It's gonna shoot me, isn't it? Yes, it's, yes, it would definitely kill me. <laughs> We've all been there. I, you know, it's worse to, like, turn in assignments or something and realize it. It's just Twitch. No one's going to judge you. And if they do, then who cares? How do I get, um... Do I have to get in there, maybe? Because I can go under this, I guess, maybe. 
No way. I'm gonna get lit up! Oh, wait. Whoa, wait. No, but I jammed. Oh! So that ended up being helpful, Cannon. Grab this. Thank you. And then unjam it, and then that thing is gonna hit that thing and kill it. And then I'm gonna come this way. Can it? Is the range far enough here? No, it won't even shoot me. Kaboom time. That's beautiful. Bang. Red sigil. Let's go. I honestly didn't know what I was doing when I jammed that. I think I've discerned some kind of pattern in the sigil. Each color serves a different purpose. Elohim has us gathering them all, but perhaps he's being overzealous. Well... I don't know about that last part, that's sort of subjective, but the um, things being different, the sigils being different is definitely true. Okay, this one is still not dead, so I need to be aware of that, but I want to get in here because there was a star. Some, it's, okay, this isn't even the one that I was trying to get, I don't think. Was it? I don't think so. What was inside that other blue gate? Um, this here? Was that before? Because if it was before, I just did it, or you just asked it now, I think it's the same answer. Because I got a star, right? But in here, did this reset? No, it did not reset. I need a so the problem is I need a box and I can't yeah so I think I kind of messed up big time I can reset it with X um let's try I'm gonna reset this so that I can have my boxes back there where my boxes is over here Okay, one. And this is simply, I'm, I am like resolving the puzzle. We know how to do it though. So I just put this on to sort of mess them up. And then I grab it. E don't touch me. Get away from me. Okay, and then I come over here and then do this and then jump on it and then jump on it and then grab it. And then, yeah, the sigil was here, but look, yeah, see? So, what the deal? Can I jump on... No, I'm not high enough. I would need two bot. What? I can jump on this, but I can't... What? I can jump on this, it says. Did it not say that? That was weird. Oh, a star. <laughs> yeah, I might have I might have missed your I might have been a bit behind. I apologize. Yeah, um there's a gate over there somehow. I don't see any other entrance to so how would I get over? Can I just... wait, hold on. No! No! I didn't want to go over it. I wanted to... I wanted to try to... Oh, could I like hop onto that thing and then walk? No, there's no way. My character wouldn't be... Um... I'll, a hint would be okay. A hint would be okay. Um, yeah, don't don't like tell me the answer straight up, but you can give me a hint. And in the meantime, I'm going to start another puzzle, and this is a cube. Um, no, I won't be offended. Uh, hints are fine. I just don't want you know like obviously this is a puzzle channel. Like my channel's based on puzzling. Puzzling. So, you know, I want to just try to, like, 
if people want to watch me suffer, then like that's fine because I might be stupid sometimes. But yeah, no, a hint, a hint is okay and appreciated. So thank you for your consideration. Um, I can't just what? Wait, hold on. Here. I can't see both. I could from right here though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I think that's the that's the point. So first grab this here. And then put it here. So this is like the whole elevation of connectors coming into play. So let's Connect that and this and place it on it and yep that, that'll do it. Okay, perfect. Nice. Okay, yeah, the green ones are definitely not hard. <laughs> you know you mustn't cross the streams. You know you mustn't. Well, here's our sigil. And there's only a blue one, but two connectors and a box. Oh boy. Well, let's just start with the obvious. Let's get the box and the blue light. There's no other connector. Um, well, it stands to reason that I should just put this connector on a box, right? Yeah, that one is dark. We just did a puzzle exactly like this. <laughs> Where uh, I go this way? I'm bad? Where do I go? Where's the entrance? Over here. Uh, I'm walking into the wall. Okay, we have another green one. One little buzzer. There's a red laser. That's That's new. Buzzbot. Yeah. So when he runs into the stream... It opened for a second, though. Wait, let's try to optimize the, the, the position. If I get it, like, as close as I possibly can right here, then I'll maximize the time that he's, like... Okay, I should be able to get it right here. Try to get in and out. Oh, there's also a box over there. Ah, yeah. Okay. The box is definitely... <laughs> Well, could I just keep you from being a nuisance? Otherwise, I could put him on a box, probably. Stop bullying my stream. What's beeping? Just the fact that I have B now? I think those are other, like, buildings. Because so far, we haven't used them for anything. Okay, I think I'm done yes okay but we know where that one star is it's in here but we just haven't found a way to get to it let's maybe Um, I could reset this again, but my, my thing is I would have one box over here and I wouldn't know exactly what to do with it. There's a, what is this? What is this? Suddenly the rain stops and returns. Is that... Where did... Whoa! Oh, snap! What? There's a connector back here. And... Red light. Maybe... Is it in this puzzle? 
No, there's no light in this puzzle. There's... What the... What the... That freaking... <laughs> this wire, ironically, is what led to the solution because I found it, but it had nothing, but then it led me to come over here. What the heck? Okay. Star received. That is beautiful. I think that we might have aced this world then. Okay, so you can't take the connector past the blue, or you can't take any tools. And long rain comes in handy after all, correct. Sunlight makes it much easier to see long distances. Oh, wow. That was the... What? Okay. Well, that was perfect, and I think that we... That was so satisfying to... The more I converse with the terminals, the more I wonder what role they play in this contraption. How do you tell friend from foe when no obvious lines are drawn between the two? Sometimes you need to just consider her. Yeah, we aced this world. That's what's up. But this is beeping at us, so let's check it out. You've received a reply to your user support ticket. Let's display. I believe the rain stops when you found the sigils. Okay, okay. Um, have I completed the standard troubleshooting procedures? Did I delete my user account? Am I dumb? Should I not have done that? I wanted an admin account, right? So, create new admin account. We did this already. Certification already exists. <laughs> Would I like to undertake certification again to to receive a preferable outcome? I guess. Okay. I guess I didn't get the outcome that I wanted from from the computer. Okay, so we have five worlds down. I think that this is probably where I'm gonna end the stream for tonight. Um, we have five worlds down, not all the stars from one through four, but like one star from one through three, and then, or I'm sorry, one through four, and then in five, we just aced it. So that's super good. That's a good feeling. We ran into them randomly, um, which is nice because a lot of the stars are like hidden. But, um, Gordita Freeman, thank you for the follow and the host. Thank you for stopping in. I love having company, and I hope that you like puzzle games. It sounds like you like this game as much as I do, so that's a good sign. Uh, Trick, all, as well, thanks for stopping in. Um, a boomer raging at the terminals because he can't remember their password. Yeah, that, I mean, in, in the beginning, I, when it asked for that, I feel like there was no correct answer like there were five different passwords and three attempts and i mean i could be wrong about that but i guess i mean i figured three out of five and they were wrong every time so it just wants you to like create a a a, a new account so that it can ask you these things and then grill you on them later but anyway so thank you everyone for stopping in i'm gonna log off for the night but i will see you next time i'm sure that i will be streaming sometime soon have a good night everybody